Dealing with migration now, as the Home Office resorts to paying Albanian TikTokers in an effort to curb channel migrants. Rishi will enlist social media stars in countries responsible for a large amount of illegal migration to publicise new laws, including the threat of deportation to Rwanda. The influencers, who have been chosen for their appeal to young men, will be paid up to £5,000 a post. Amongst the social media stars chosen are a rapper who uses his platform to encourage youngsters to work hard, a comedian whose northern Albanian accent could appeal to men in target regions, and an American travel blogger who fell in love with Albania and uses TikTok to celebrate the country. As part of the government's million-pound advertising blitz, more campaigns will take place in Iraq, Egypt and Vietnam, with further plans to introduce them in Turkey and India. I know this sounds crazy. I know it sounds like, like a ludicrous idea, but you can't underestimate how much TikTok and social media is used to attract people <coughs> or, to, or to go on these small dingers. The, the campaigns that these people smugglers are doing on there is incredibly, mm -hmm. uh, inc incredibly lucrative for them. So having some people uh, do the opposite to counter it, it I, sounds yeah, crazy, but they I are don't easily counter it. sounds crazy at all. I okay, think it's good. completely I think it's a rational. Idea. Oh, you yeah. know, I, I myself yeah. have seen some of the videos that asylum seekers in UK hotels are putting on TikTok, basically glorifying the journey they've made, acting like this is a really cool thing to do. And when they get here, it's the golden ticket. Literally, asylum seekers chucking money in these TikTok videos. So, of course, we should be countering that. In fact, it's the first sensible thing yeah. I've heard the Home Office doing. They've tried everything else. Try this. It's a great idea. And you're right, in terms of those videos, you've seen them lying back, stretched out on right, the bed, having so a insulting. wonderful time, saying, come to the UK. I mean, it's got to be countered. And if this is the right way to do it, it's worth it. It's worth a shot. It is worth a shot, and I hate to burst your bubble because everyone's saying, oh, it's the first good idea. So, obviously, this all came out with... There would have been some blue-sky thinking, <laughs> civil service, and they said, yes, TikTok. And as you're, you're, you're absolutely right as well, this is the way that a lot of these people first hear about these trips. The trouble is... Not a single one of these influencers is going to do it. And they've already said this evening that they're not going to do it. Because to be an influencer, you have to be cool. cool. Mm. The last thing you want as an influencer is it being known that you've taken £5,000 from Rishi Sunak's government to put something on your TikTok account. Mm. And every single one um, that the Times journalist contacted about this story, who had they, they haven't agreed to do it, they were just the ones that were on the government's hit list as the really influential TikTokers. Every single one has said, I'd rather stick pins in my eyes. Well, I, I bet you some them. of them... Yes, yeah, I bet you I some of them will do it. It's five grand for yeah. one yeah, TikTok but some, of the, post, some of these I people mean... earn a lot, a lot more than that. Can, can I just say, JJ, Isabel, David, Daisy, you're all bonkers on this one, frankly. <laughs> right. um, and I'll explain why, because <laughs> okay. this is how the on, TikToker then. video will go. As if you know. Do not come yeah. to the UK. All you will get is free accommodation, warmth, <laughs> food, 40 quid a week, education, yeah. health service. It's just not worth it. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I mean, I can't imagine what else they're going to say. I mean, but what... The, because if you are escaping, they're let's say, say the worst scenario, a, a tyrannical regime, yeah. and you really need safety, then, frankly, well, what uh, is being offered here, and I would say in France and Germany, gonna, gonna, is all right. To, but they're going to give a counter-narrative, which is to say, don't believe the videos you're watching, because it's not live. Yeah. And actually, when you get what here... What is it like, Dave? Well, the, the idea is that you will be, hopefully, processed quickly, and then if, if you arrive here and you, you are not right to claim asylum, you will be removed and quickly. Yes. But, again, you have and to you... have... The, well, that isn't and actually, you need to be able to do no, it. And, and, and you might, you, you, you might catch those. Legionnaire's disease on the Bibby yes, Stockholm. Yes, that's right. Yeah, for I free. mean, come on, Ian. I Are think you... I think you're being unnecessarily provocative here. You know perfectly well <laughs> that it's quite possible to construct a TikTok advert which puts people off. I mean, they will literally show... They could be showing headlines of people drowning in the channel. That yeah. has happened. They can show terrible bits of a Bibby Stockholm accommodation. Not that I think it's that bad, but the Legionnaires thing. There's plenty of things they can you do could, to make... I... Always raining. I mean, that might... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's always raining. They've got a programme called Love Island on the tap. You know, I mean, goodness <laughs> me, you could go through those kinds. Mm. Yeah. Well, they could still just target... Um, Advertising. They haven't got to use the influencers. And I honestly think that if you there. are if, if you are coming over a boat for whatever reason, coming over on a boat for whatever reason, then frankly, I don't think a TikTok campaign. No, but is you've going missed the somehow. point, which is that if they're looking and comparing different countries, maybe oh, they will decide. Shopping I'll go, around. I'll, shopping around. I'll go to Italy <laughs> instead. Maybe. <laughs> well, you get maybe. a few more quid. Food's in Italy. better. The weather's so, better. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. The weather's yeah. a lot better. Maybe. Yeah.